A local mother has created a support group to help families of children with autism spectrum disorder find the resources they need. The Rural Autism Family Group was founded by Autumn Hargit. The group works to provide support for families with a focus in Walker County right now. Hargit says she understands what parents of children with autism are going through. Her son Nicholas and daughter Maggie have been diagnosed with autism spectrum disorder. Hargit says when someone first suggested her daughter had autism after showing signs, she did not believe it. You, you want to see me get mad you look at me with my two-year-old daughter and tell me that my daughter has autism I got fighting mad because I didn't know I was completely ignorant on it I didn't have any idea what I was looking at and you know I finally cracked and I finally said well something's got to make sense Hargit says finding support for her children was not easy um, I did my research didn't have anybody to talk to didn't know anybody with it you know had to find it all out on my own you know Google books libraries you know uh, night after night after night of no sleep Hargit says that's why Rural Autism Family was formed. The Facebook group includes mothers and families of children with autism spectrum disorder. That's what we're here for, to help network and give the knowledge that we spent years trying to find. We went through it alone and we did it and we don't want to see anybody else go through that again. Hargit says people with autism are often misunderstood due to the lack of awareness about the disorder. This can lead to children not getting the help and assistance they need from schools in the community and be victims of harsh judgment. If they're lucky enough to be able to get those doors opened, then they can, you know, they can learn how to manipulate the world and how to get through, you know, and how to accomplish anything else that anybody else would ever want to do. They just learn it a different way. It's a different path. Hargit has been going to city council meetings throughout Walker County to encourage city leaders to sign autism-friendly city proclamations, which include the proclamation of awareness, education, and inclusion promoted by the city. Hargit is also working with city and county leaders to ensure all first responders in the county be trained and know how to respond to people with autism. Hargit says the group still has a lot of work ahead to make the county and state a more inclusive and understanding place. She hopes her efforts encourages others. It just really goes to show that anybody can do this. Yeah. I mean, I don't have credentials. I don't have, you know, a college background. I don't have a degree to be able to do any of this. But we're getting it done. And as long as we're getting it done, then we're going to keep going. We're literally going to keep going until, you know, I just drop dead. That'll be when we stop. <laughs> Reporting in Walker County, Cameron Edgeworth, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.